is the standard fee for a straightforward car wreck case. My firm generally charges that. Sometimes we handle a lot of uh, a lot of legal malpractice cases, and so typically a fee in a legal malpractice case will be higher because you have to, in essence, you have to prepare and and go to trial on two different cases. First, you have to present the the trial of the underlying case. You have to show what the lawyer didn't do, what the what the value is of the underlying case. Let's say a car wreck case. You have to put that case on trial, and then on top of that, you have to you have to then show the focus of what the lawyer didn't do. Uh, and so, uh, we handle a lot of those, a lot of legal malpractice cases. It's just always been my belief that a lawyer ought to be held accountable, just like everybody else. Uh, I think uh, I, I believe in accountability for doctors, and in my experience of handling a lot of medical malpractice cases over the years. I have seen many, many instances where doctors will try to cover up for each other. They won't tell their patients the truth about what happened. Um, many times I can't even get a doctor to talk to me about a case, even if I know the case has merit. And I did not want to be a part of that kind of hypocrisy. So at my firm, we handle legal malpractice cases regularly. Uh, holding lawyers accountable is one of the most gratifying things that I do, one of the things that I'm most proud of.